Hello everyone, welcome to our Monday Minute. Today we're going to discuss the advanced and accelerated payments um, that agencies are going to be responsible for returning um, to Medicare. Um, last year at the beginning of the pandemic, um, in April or so of 2020, home health agencies and hospices alike were allowed to request advanced payments um, from the Medicare MAC to the tune of approximately three months of reimbursement that they would typically see. Um, CMS at that point made a calculation to determine the maximum amount any one agency would be allowed to request from the Medicare MAC, and then you had to fill out a form, submit it to your Medicare MAC, either requesting the maximum amount or an amount lesser than that. Um, once those funds were distributed, um, you were told that 120 days from the time that you received those funds, they would be recouping that money at 100% um, until they recovered uh, the full amount. Um, then we got to August of 2020, which is basically the time period um, that would have been about the beginning of the 120 days from the first distributions, um, and nothing happened. And so inquiries were made, and finally, um, we received information in approximately October of 2020 to tell us that they had changed their mind about the way they were going to recoup and the timing of the recoupment. They announced that they would be recouping the amounts beginning one year from the time that the funds were distributed. So if you received a distribution in April of 2020, your recoupment will begin in April of 2021. Um, when that recoupment begins, they will be recouping 25% of your Medicare reimbursement amounts as you bill final claims for the first 11 months of the recoupment process. Once they get to the end of 11 months, if at deducting 25% of your reimbursement has not fully paid back the amount um, that you had originally been advanced, uh, they will then, for the next six months, recoup at 50%. After the end of that six months, which is now a total of 17 months, if there is still a balance left um, from the advance payments you were given, um, they are going to issue you a letter telling you the remaining balance that you have, and within 30 days, they will begin accruing interest at the rate of 4%. So I, I wanted to share this with you today because the one year time frame um, is coming up very, very quickly. In fact, in April of 2021 is when most of this um, should begin. Um, we have had no information from CMS whatsoever that this will be delayed. Um, however, we didn't get told until the last minute and even after the last minute last year when it was supposed to happen in August that it wasn't going to happen in August. Uh, but I did want you to make sure that you were prepared um, for the reality of the fact that it is likely going to start recruitment in April. Um, in the uh, content of this video, um, there will be a link um, to a webinar that I have recorded that discusses both the advanced accelerated payments and the provider relief fund um, reporting that is going to start shortly um, but has not begun as of yet. Thank you all for joining me today. I hope this has been helpful. Um, if there is or were to be an update to uh, the recruitment beginning in April of 2021, we will make sure to let you know. Um, thank you as always for taking care of patients during this public health emergency and make sure if you need additional information um, regarding these advanced accelerated payments that you contact us or your state home care associations.